here with the 2022 PFL Women's Lightweight Champion, Larissa Pacheco, and her whole team. This is awesome. We have everyone here. Uh, Larissa, we're a little less than two days after the fight. Uh, how are you feeling? Are you still riding the high of the win? I'm here with the champion of the PFL, and two years later, it's going to be on the end of the victory. Ah, com certeza, né? Aproveitando aqui com o meu time, meu empresário, minha, meus, meus técnicos, aproveitando esse momento que é, é o único. Yeah, I'm here with my team, with my manager, with my trainers, just enjoying the moment, which is unique. Yeah, and obviously uh, an amazing performance by you, amazing fight. I know how confident you were going into this third fight with Kayla, but... How far into it, when you guys were actually fighting, did you realize, like, this is my night, this is going to be different than the previous two fights? Lutão, você parecia muito confiante entrando na luta, mas durante a luta, qual foi o momento que você falou isso vai ser meia-noite? Acho que em todo momento eu entrei com a cabeça de que eu iria vencer, independente se fosse round a round ou se viesse um knockout ou uma finalização. Eu estava ligado ao tempo Todo. É, a gente não pode diminuir a, a, a Kyla, óbvio que não, ela é uma grande atleta, a gente fez uma grande luta, mas eu busquei isso a todo round. You know, I was pretty confident, I didn't know if it was going to be over the five rounds or if I was going to get a knockout, of course, Kayla is a, is a very good fighter, um, it was a great fight, but I was really confident that I would come out with the win. Does she feel any different in there compared to the last times, or do you feel like most of the changes were on your side as far as why uh, the fight played out differently than the previous two? Você sentiu ela, ela alguma coisa diferença nela na luta ou foi mais ou menos que esperado? Na outra luta você sentiu alguma diferença nela dessa luta para outra luta? Sim, sim, com certeza. Senti que ela estava mais confiante, ela estava confiante mais nos chutes mais na trocação, eu sei que ela estava fazendo isso mais para me mostrar é, que, que, que não, não, não mostrar que ela iria entrar na queda, mas ela estava mais, mais solta um pouco, apesar de, de, de eu estar superior em, em algumas partes, mas ela, eu, como, como ela quis impor muito o jogo dela, e a diferença não foi tão grande assim. Yeah, she was loose in the striking. I mean, she was trying to impose her game. I didn't feel that big a difference, but she was more confident. You know, she was, she was, she was trying to impose her game. You know, it wasn't a big difference, but she was, she seemed like she was more confident. It seemed like over the fight, though, that confidence did go away a little bit. Uh, a lot of us had it 2-2 going into that fifth round. And obviously your ability to stop that takedown and you know, land the hammer fists on the leg and stuff, that was a really big you know, uh, moment in the fight for you. Did you feel like in that fifth round it was 2-2 and you needed that round to end, uh, win the fight in round five? Parecia que chegando no último round, estava 2-2. Aí naquele round você conseguiu evitar o takedown conseguir acertar bastante martelada nela, é, você sentiu isso também? Senti, senti que estava empatado, é, senti que eu precisava de qualquer forma ali acertar ela, independente de onde que eu estava, se eu estava em pé, se eu estava por baixo, e conforme o quarto round acabou, eu vi o quanto ela ficou machucada devido a eu estar batendo nela por baixo, né? o quanto ela sentiu. Yeah, I, I knew that it was tight. I knew that I had to, to step it up. Uh, between rounds, I, I saw how much I managed to hurt her striking uh, from the bottom, and I knew that I had to keep on doing that. And just one for you, Jukau. Um, obviously, you know, the game plan here, can you, I know you might have to fight Kayla again in the future, so maybe don't want to give away everything, but um, how close to the game plan that you laid out for Larissa did she execute in this fight? So, yeah, we, we, we haven't talked with Kayla since the, the last, the last Grand Prix, you know, the last tournament, you know, and we, me and Joao and all the coach, we haven't talked consistently about like tendency like what like a Kayla bring to the table all the time when is the click when Kayla feeling she need to shoot it and we just drilling in her exercise the 
over and over and over, you know. Also, uh, we put Larissa a little bit more patient instead to go there and execute the, the, the fight, you know, what she always have been doing that. And you know, a, and, oh, go ahead. Go ahead. No, I was just going to say, as a, as a coach, you know, having eight rounds between them to go off coming into this one, uh, how much does that help, you know, with the game plan and you feel the success in this third fight, you know, having the information from the previous two? Can you repeat again? Sorry. I just... I'll repeat. Como que a tendo os outros dez rounds, as outras lutas ajudou para essa luta aí? Yeah, of course. You know, all those two fights she did on the past where she had like eight rounds with her, right? And this is like, a, if you if you see like the first fight, the second fight, you can see like every fight is getting, I mean, Larissa is getting more, given more difficult for Kayla, you know? The game plan was like, a, of course, avoid the takedowns, you know, don't let her make her strategy to like keep it eat the rounds. And once La Larissa could avoid the takedowns, I, we all believe she could be better on, on the feet, you know? And this happened very well. And she also did a good job on the ground too. You know, as you can see, she don't let her mount, she don't let her pass her guard, she recompose the guard all the time. And she also get on the feet and defend the takedowns. It was, it was on point and we, we, every, the whole team was very confident should be a, a victory tonight. Yeah, and uh, back for you, Larissa. I mean, the fact that you won this fight in a hard-fought 25-minute decision, um, how good does that feel? Obviously, you know, you had all the first-round knockouts coming in, but to win a fight like this, does it make it more gratifying than maybe if it ended quickly or something? How was it the game of a luta very hard during five rounds in order to knock out? Isso traz mais um valor dessa luta para você? Com certeza, traz valor. Eu enfrentei uma grande atleta, né? É, eu, eu acho que essa luta me credibilizou tanto quanto se eu tivesse ganho com um simples nocaute. Né? Então, mostrou o quanto eu sou dura, o quanto ela é dura, o quanto a gente pode aguentar e fazer um grande combate. Yeah, I do. I faced a really, really tough opponent. Maybe if I had knocked her out, I wouldn't get that kind of appeal. You know, it was... Um... She's a very, very good fighter. It was a very, very tough fight, and I think that credentialed me to show how good we are, both me and her are. And can you just try to explain, you know, how good this win feels? I mean, you've been through the PFL seasons. You've been through, you know, the, the ups, the downs, and to win it like this, you know, on pay-per-view against Kayla. Um, just what, can you explain what this moment feels like for you? O que esse movimento significa para você? Você já veio aqui, já lutou com ela de novo? O que, que significa essa, essa vitória para você? Ah, essa vitória significa todo um trabalho né, que foi feito, toda uma dedicação aí de anos. Não é um, nada contra a Kyla, mas ela era que estava na minha frente, eu precisava vencê-la para poder me realizar né, como atleta, como profissional e ganhar de, 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 ganhar de, uma, de uma campeã olímpica, ganhar de uma pessoa que estava sendo tão tão bem falada no, no, no meio do MMA, sendo a mulher considerada a rainha do, do, do MMA, isso é gratificante, é a realização de um sonho. Yeah, it means a lot. There's many years of work to get here and to have beaten Kayla, nothing against her, but have beaten her a, a two-time gold medalist, uh, somebody that everybody was saying was the toughest female fighter on the planet, and for, to come out on the win, it really, really means a lot to me. Did Kayla say anything to you after the fight? Me? Ah, uh, no, to Larissa. Kayla falou alguma coisa com você depois da luta? Ah, a gente se encontrou nos bastidores, ela me parabenizou. A gente sempre se respeitou muito, né? Então, ela foi, ela foi bem amistosa. Yes, she came and talked to me afterwards. She was very respectful, she was very friendly. Yeah, are you, uh, how do you feel about how, the way she's handling the loss? She made no excuses, she's giving you all your credit. Uh, do you appreciate that from her? Como você acha que ela tá lidando com a derrota? Ela não faz desculpa, te dá todo o crédito. Ah, eu acho que dando bem, né? A gente precisa ser consciente das coisas. É, todas as vezes que eu perdi para ela, fui bem consciente de que ela foi superior a mim. Trabalhei para que é, viesse a ser superior a ela nesse momento. E eu, ela, ela, ela é uma atleta, ela sabe lidar com as coisas, ela sabe lidar com a derrota. E 
não chega a ser uma derrota, acho que tudo dentro do nosso meio é aprendizado. Yes, I think that she's dealing with it well. I mean, listen, I lost twice to her and I had to deal with it. Um, it's it's part of the game, you know. You have to learn how to deal with uh, with uh, with uh, with the loss as well. But I think she's dealing well with it. Yeah, for sure. So, as far as you know, what happens from here? Obviously, uh, PFL has kind of hinted that Kayla is no longer going to be a part of these seasons anymore. Um, what do you, from your side, what do you think happens next? Do you guys do this fight again when the season starts in April? Do you want to do, you know, the season to defend this championship? Well, what are your plans from here? What happens from here? Parece que Kayla não vai estar mais na temporada. E aí, você o que você acha? Qual a sua perspectiva? Em abril, o que vai acontecer? Fazer uma luta com ela, ou, com ou ir pro GP? Ah, eu não sei, né? Acho que isso a gente ainda vai conversar muito. Eu, o Alex, a gente vai analisar o que que, o que que vai ser feito. Mas acredito que para ela não tem nenhuma outra escolha, né? A não se passar por mim de novo. E a gente fazer essa revanche, uma super luta, quem sabe. Né? A gente tá em busca de vencer e ser eu ser uma das a melhor do mundo aí, sempre em busca de, de vencer as melhores, já consegui vencê-la. Agora tem outras aí também. E é isso, vamos continuar trabalhando. Yeah, we're going to sit down with Alex with the team, we're going to analyze. I think that think that it's inevitable that we fight again. I want to fight the best. I want to show I'm one of the best. And I think that the, the fight's going to have to happen again. Yeah, there's been some talk about PFL, you know, maybe doing a women's featherweight season. Um, would you consider moving down to 145, or do you feel like 155 is where you need to be? Ah, tem a conversa que eles vão passar a fazer 145. Você quer descer para 145 ou você está onde você precisa estar? Eu estou onde eu preciso estar. Eu acredito que agora eu sendo a campeã, eles não têm por que acabar com uma, uma categoria em que eu represento muito bem. Então, acho que isso tem que ser bem, bem analisado é, dentro da organização. Porque eles têm uma nova campeã agora. Né? A gente tem meninas aí para colocar para lutar. Então, elas têm que ser selecionadas, né? tem que aparecer. Mas eu estou no lugar onde eu deveria estar. Estou tô, tô, tô fazendo isso muito bem. E é isso, quero continuar no setembro. Eu quero ficar desse jeito. Eu represento esse jeito muito bem. I think there are other good girls out there. Um, I don't see why we'd have to change the vision when we already have a new champion. And I hope to keep on fighting right at this weight. That's fair for sure. And I mean, with it being 2-1 with Kayla now, uh, do you expect that before it's all said and done, you guys fight twice more and it's kind of a best of five? Já tá 2 a 1, um, você é queira, você acha que você luta mais duas vezes para ser a melhor de cinco? Ah, com certeza, né? Eu acho que a gente precisa disso. Ela ainda tá ganhando por um e eu preciso empatar e virar esse jogo. Yeah, we need that. She's winning, winning by one, I gotta, I gotta tie it and then beat her. Awesome. Um, and a couple more things before I let you go. You know, everyone talks so much about, you know, the, the million dollars and everything that comes with a PFL championship. Uh, how life changing is this win for you kind of on the financial front and things you're able to do now with this money that you want? Todo mundo fala do milhão de dólares. Como que isso muda a sua vida de repente tendo um dinheiro desse na tua vida? Sua coisa? vida financeira. Sua vida financeira. Ah, melhora tudo, né? É, eu posso hoje ter uma, um conforto de não contar com pessoas que já não queriam me ajudar. Que é muito difícil, né? Pra, dentro do nosso, do nosso esporte, principalmente sendo mulher, é, os empresários, os governantes quererem ajudar a gente. Então isso me dá um conforto para que eu consiga trabalhar e melhorar cada vez mais. Yeah, it's going to make things more comfortable. It's very difficult for somebody like me that we don't get a lot of support. Politicians don't give us support. Businesses don't give us support. So now it's going to give it, give me more comfort to to um, to manage to support myself and train correctly. That's amazing. And just last thing, um, how confident and proud of yourself do you feel right now? You said going into this fight, pretty much everything that would happen, you feel you've evolved. You don't feel that she's evolved quite enough. Uh, you know, you know what you can do in there to win, and you went out there and did it all. Um, what does that do for your confidence going forward and potentially into another fight with Kayla that you could repeat this performance again? Como se sente confiante para a próxima luta? Você evoluiu, você melhorou. Que tipo de confiança isso te dá para uma próxima luta? 
total confiança. Isso, a cada luta com ela, eu consegui expor cada vez mais o jogo dela. É, hoje, eu, o, na nossa última luta, agora eu senti ela diferente, mas também fui diferente. Então, tudo que ela pôde evoluir, eu consegui tirar dela daí. É, muita coisa a gente já está trabalhando, já está vendo em cima, porque a gente sabe que é uma possível próxima luta. Então, tem, tem muita coisa aí que, que dá para a gente trabalhar e aumenta cada vez mais a minha confiança. Yeah, I felt that I evolved a lot on on a lot of her, of her areas. That makes me really confident. We have a lot to improve still, and we're going to keep on working, you know, for the next fight. You know what, Mike? I'm gonna she's going to do the takedowns now. There we go. And I guess one for you, Alex. Is it the expectation that uh, we're back here in April? You know, when the PFL season restarts, is that when you guys expect to fight again? You know what, Mike? In my mind, of course, I'm not the promotion or anything, but if I'm a promoter, I want to put this fight again. I think everybody wants to see it. Who don't want to do? Don't you want to see that fight again? It's the only fight to make, in my opinion. Yeah, that's what I think. That's what I'm hearing. It's still two days out, so we have to let the dust settle, see where Kale's at and everything. But in my mind, it's the fight that has to happen. I think both girls deserve it. They deserve a big payday. Um, They're, they're definitely some of the best female fighters in the world. And everybody wants to see them fight again. People will pay to see them fight again. So I think it's the right thing to do. Agreed. Well, uh, I want to let you guys all celebrate now. Appreciate you doing this so soon after the fight. And really appreciate the time. Congratulations again, Larissa. That was an amazing performance. Thank you so much, Mike. Thank I love you, you, man. Hey, Mike. Right. Thanks so much, man. Thank appreciate you. it. Have a great day, everyone. Too, man.